I guess like it's always those, you know, the boys, right? They talk about something deep and yeah. they're like, let's make a podcast and never do it. They would never exactly. do it. Yeah. So this was started back in, I would say, November 11th, 2019. And so I was going through, I guess this is always someone's story, but I was going through a breakup and there was this guy, he used to be a member. He, we was both going through the same thing. And whenever we would hang out, we would always just have these deep conversations. They weren't really deep, deep, but they were deep. And he was like, yeah, man, let's start a podcast. So I'm like, okay. I mean, I don't don't really know. but um, And so the next day when he said it, he really kept on being persistent on it. So I was like, okay. So I looked up different ways. So like I said, this is another thing. If you ever want to do a podcast and for you to have a cha- uh, multiple channels for you to spread. I recommend using uh, Anchor. It's mainly for Spotify users, but it does connect to um, Apple Music. I, just a lo- It has a lot of different channels for you to connect to. And, and I did my research. We made an account, and we did audios before. And then something happened, and I was like, you know what? I got it. You know, he wasn't really being persistent as I was missing deadlines, missing time, you know, just not doing the things that he was supposed to do. And so I kind of took a break from it. And then when I transferred to UCG, because I was in Waytech at the time, um, I did it with a couple different people. And it was a it was just a lot because dealing with a podcast, there's just people you got to have the right team right yeah. because if you got too many bosses and i've seen this a lot in podcasts to where people come and go and leave because they either are not committed enough or you got so many people who's trying to be leaders instead of i'm not saying followers as in like follow somebody they just gotta play their role yeah, yeah yes and so when you got people to where they're not doing that they're suggesting ideas because i had other people into it as well and they were not they were not they were not doing that they were not trying to you know they we had different visions for it so again i stopped talking to them in that aspect of promoting the podcast then i was in the communications class and i i guess that's when i started promoting so that's when that network niche started to come to me and i started to say hey i got a podcast do 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 and i was very outspoken in that category but I had the wrong people, right? So even if you got, I would say, even if you got so many different people that want to do it, they got to follow their role in their niche. Exactly. So I got rid of them. And then I was like, I don't know. And then that meeting came up. And then, and then that's when I met KJ and Xavier. So.